What's up, everybody? So, I'm here working on the old 1972 International Scout, and I ran into a little bit of a weird problem. And I got a fix, so I figured I'd share it. So, uh, this thing's got a Dana 30 front end in it. Apparently, they only use this specific front end in 72 and 73. For some reason, International specified that the inner seal be a different outside diameter. This particular thing, for some reason. So there's a seal that goes in here, right here on this lip, on both sides. And for some reason, it's 80,000 smaller those two particular years this is what the seal looked like originally of course you pretty much wreck it getting it out of there um, yeah and I don't know why it's different but uh, it is for those two years I've looked all over the place cannot buy a new one none of the seal manufacturers make anything with that outside diameter that fits it's one inch 920 all the catalogs say that the thing uses a two inch OD seal. So it's just been a real pain in the ass. Um, I was discussing my displeasure of internationals with a friend of mine that's into internationals. Telling him the whole situation and he's like, well, why don't you just make a spacer and put a new seal in it, the smaller? And he's a machinist, so I said, well, why don't you? So he did. So, here's what I got. I found this seal here, 540903. It has a smaller outside diameter, but it's the same inside diameter and the same thickness. So, my buddy Lauren, thanks Lauren, machined up these little. Let me get a better shot here. Get some background machine me up this little spacer and then the new seal fits inside the spacer pretty friggin trick huh and then you take this whole little thing and it gets pressed in there so if you're one of those poor bastards that's using one of these Dana 30 front ends, can't buy a seal, go make friends with somebody with a machine shop. Have them make you a little spacer. That's what I did. See ya.